Hey everybody, uh, welcome to Brick Hive. Thank you for joining me. So this is just a quick video. Um, I just wanted to do kind of a city update and a camera test at the same time. The city updates, nothing in particular. I just kind of wanted to swoop the camera around the city a little bit uh, and just show you guys some stuff. Maybe you haven't seen everything in there. Maybe you're new to the channel and you haven't seen it. Um, and I also wanted to test this uh, camera that I have that I basically just use for one particular thing, but I wanted to try it out and see if it would work good for this. So, all right, let's get to the city. All right, so I got a lot of natural sunlight coming in the room right now. As you can see my shadow, obviously. But, um, all right, I'm going to start kind of over here and everything's a mess, but again, I'm just kind of testing this camera out to see if I should use this a little more often when doing like city updates and stuff. So they got the T-Rex and the, I don't know, what is it, the Golden Dragon? Uh, titanium, you, you'd know which one this is. So I'm just kind of scoping around. roller coaster and I'm really excited to start on the beach area soon because this is obviously no good look at this pile of minifigures look at this it's just crazy and of course we can look down the street ah. I don't know if anybody noticed in one of my city updates before Harley right here is getting ready to fap this guy right in the back of the head. And as always, I like to show off this uh, graffiti wall that I got from uh, Eclipse Graphics. This is such a cool, cool thing to put in your city. But yeah, um, this is kind of what's going on down the street. Huh? Look at that. It's a long ways down. I wonder if I can get that to focus. Wow. That's pretty good. That is pretty good. going on but yeah um, eventually you know I gotta enclose all these buildings um, I already did that actually with the uh, sandwich shop all right what else we got going on oh. so over there we've got the park which is still kind of under construction since I put the tree in the forest area next to it. Let's see if that's the stuff will focus good. Yeah. I tell you, I gotta get some sig figs going on in here pretty soon. I mean, technically, I have my wife, me, and my daughter, and the dog. And I guess the cat too, but. Oh yeah, this was uh, some of the, uh, <laughs> what are the robots, the droid army? And they were just sitting around talking. And then of course we've got the tree, which I just did a video on that. But man, that is a great tree. If, if you can get it, I highly recommend it. All right, let me kind of walk, let me kind of walk around here. Ugh. And I guess we kind of look down this way. Ugh. 
We got our Jawa mechanics still working on the Batmobile or the Bat trike. Got some kids out in this front yard playing. This lady's still painting this fence. And that lady, she's still mowing her lawn. I think, I think that's Maria Hill. And then of course, you know, got uh, the Brick Hive General Hospital. And you know, I've always liked how in the background, I've got stuff just kind of flying around, you know, like there's Iron Man, and then the uh, carriage from the Crimes of Grindelwald, Wart, Wart, bleh, I can't speak today. Uh, there's a uh, uh, Riddler's helicopter. What else was there? There's a, he's not flying right now, obviously, but there's the Beetle standing on the edge of the building. Pretty cool. Where's a Peter Pan? Like kind of running off of the tree branch, getting ready to jump up and fly away. So, yeah, I mean, um, I just kind of wanted to test out this camera. Like I said, I haven't really used it for anything other than just close-up shots when, um, like if I review something or do a speed build and then I show, you know, the close-up shot of the set or minifigure, you know, how I'll spin it around. Um, that's basically the only thing I really use this camera for. So, you know, I just thought I'd kind of test it out and see what it's like doing with something else. Um, yeah, I, I've lost track of which video is which, but uh, if I haven't shown it yet, uh, I put up a couple new shelves. So, and I hung up um, my picture of... I bought this uh, New Avengers comics and I uh, got it signed by Frank Cho. He's the artist. He's done a lot of different stuff, but he's a really cool dude, really awesome artist. Uh, hung up my TIE Fighter poster. It's kind of hard to see with the light. And then I hung up um, the Lego Captain Marvel print. Got that framed. And I just got a bunch of random stuff on here, including, you know, I got my Batmobile. That was a big thing. I just really need somewhere to put my Batmobile. But, uh, you know, I got BB-8 and the Ninjago um, arcade thingy and uh, just, you know, random, random stuff. I really like my uh, Mandalorian uh, coffee guy. <laughs> um, and then I put a couple of my uh, smaller sets over here. Lighthouse, and then I got a shelf up here, um, and I've got a few pops. These ones are actually really special to me because it's so it's you know Kylo Ren, but then I've got all the other Knights of Ren. Like I managed to get all of them, and then at the end I've got um, Dark Side Ray. It's awesome. <laughs> So, but they're not, they're just there temporarily. Um, I'm going to have a different, different shelves for the pops that I have. So I just wanted to set them up somewhere. All right. Well, that's it for this video. Uh, like I said, it was basically just a city update and a uh, camera test. So I hope you all have a great day or night. Thank you everybody for watching this video. Uh, if you like my uh, channel, if you like my content, if you like this video, um, stomp hard on that like button for me and join the Brick Hive. We're all about good times here. See you everybody.